Columbia County Sheriff's Regional Training Center graduated its very first class of recruits today. Hannah Latier was there. Agencies and leaders from across the state gathered at the sheriff's office to celebrate eight recruits graduating from Columbia County's new basic law enforcement academy. <laughs> Recruit Gilbert Bernal won three awards for the skills he demonstrated throughout the course. He'll be working for Augusta University Police and is grateful for the opportunity. The instructors were awesome. Everybody was great, professional, and they really, they really care to teach you and have you learn everything. The other recruits will be going to Greene County, Emanuel County, Columbia County, and Glasscock County, as well as Wadley and Millen. 44 law enforcement agencies from across the state will now use the 12-week academy. Leaders believe this is a vital way to reverse the officer shortage, especially in rural counties. What this will allow us to do is to fill law enforcement vacant positions in the CSRA. Uh, a lot quicker. Glasscock County Sheriff Jeremy Kelly only has five sworn officers on staff. This new deputy will help alleviate some stress. Deputy Walker is actually going to be the first sworn female deputy Glasscock County has ever had. Uh, so that's a huge step in our direction. But Deputy Walker is also going to help relieve overtime uh, on my deputies and extra work for myself. Georgia Supreme Court Justice Andrew Pinson came out to show his support. Law enforcement is just a critical part of our jobs in the justice system, upholding the rule of law, um, protecting the rights and liberties of Georgians. Right now, Georgia ranks last in the nation for the number of hours of training it requires its law enforcement officers to receive, which is just over 400. Columbia County Sheriff Clay Whittle is hoping to bring it up to 800 hours by next January. Being able to have the academy here and attract new people is going to slowly allow us to crawl out of that deficit over the next year or two, and that thrills me. The next class begins on April 22nd. Sheriff Whittle says that class should have at least double the amount of recruits. In Appling, Hannah Latier, WJBF News Channel 6.